President Donald Trump today announced a $12 billion bailout for farmers who are hurting from the president's escalating trade war over tariffs. Pat Kessler joins us right now. So, Pat, this is a sign that that trade war is hurting Midwest farmers. Yeah, it really is, including tens of millions of dollars of lost sales to Minnesota farmers, especially to soybean farmers here, trading partners like China, Canada, and the European Union, imposing very stiff tariffs on Midwest farm products to retaliate for Trump's tariffs on their countries. The president's activating a seldom used Department of Agriculture emergency program that would buy excess crops and commodities. In a speech today, the president asked farmers to stay with him and not believe reports that a trade war is a bad thing. Number, just stick with us. Don't believe the crap you see from these people, the fake news. It's all working out. And just remember, what you're seeing and what you're reading is not what's happening. Well, a lot of people still don't see that. The president's bailout program drew widespread criticism from farm state lawmakers of both parties, including in Wisconsin, Republican Senator Ron Johnson, who said farmers want trade, not aid. Instead of throwing money at a problem we've helped create, said Johnson, the better option is to make it easier for farmers to sell their goods at fair prices. So this is going to be going on for many weeks, perhaps months, but a lot of people very uneasy about where yeah. it stands right now. All right, Pat. Thank you. You bet.